And what's really interesting is that most people, they think inflammation. So what do you normally think of? They're like, oh, I sprained my ankle, it inflames, right? Or my gut's all inflamed because I ate the wrong things. Uh, you know, you can think of, or I have an infection. That's what people usually think of with inflammation, but your body doesn't know the difference. It That's doesn't right. know the difference between any of those stresses that you just talked about. And that is such a good point because when you have chronic stress or emotional stress, it actually creates inflammation same in the body as all of those other things. And, and now they're finding that if you have that chronic inflammation of your brain because you're using it, you're wired all the time, they're finding that you can actually increase things like Alzheimer's, cognitive decline by twofold right. in that chronic inflammatory right. state. I think it was one of the states, I have it right here, it was a 2022 paper in Natural Aging found that middle-aged adults elevated inflammatory mark with inflammatory markers had more than twice the risk of cognitive decline later in life. That's it's crazy. crazy.